Hi, this is Paul and welcome to my golf cave. Today I am playing Lake Maury uh, Country Club out of Fairleigh, Vermont. And uh, looking forward to playing this course. Just downloaded it from GS Pro. Uh, I have my uh, Bushnell Launch Pro launch monitor all ready to go. It is raining outside and thundering, uh, so it's a little bit dark in here. I don't feel like turning on the lights. Let's go. I've chosen the first hole, which is for me a long par three, 214 yards. Uh, I have the uh, uh, 12th hole and I believe the 18th hole. The course I'm playing from the back tees, which sounds short, only about 5,800, a little over yards. So uh, should be a relatively short course. Put it on... Um, the course recommended conditions, which is breezy. So uh, doing that, let's see what I'm looking at here. Uh, 214, it is about, oh, just five miles an hour from the west to east. And I think the stimp on this one is about a 10. So the green should be relatively what I consider soft. Anyway, got my three wood out, 214 yards. Just done a little bit of practice with some uh, some nine irons, but nothing other than that. Let's see what we can do. And I skied it. And because of that, I'm taking a breakfast ball. Let's see. Um, did I set this up so I could take a breakfast ball? Yes, I did. I thought I might have had the tea a little bit high, so I put it on a lower tea. And let's give this a whirl again. Decent strike. Yeah, a little short. Uh, part of it is because I'm not warmed up, but uh, have to change that in a hurry. 32 yards out of the sand. Thinking I need a good. Uh, Good 40 yard shot. <laughs> that was not that. <laughs> All right. So we will have a long one for par 29 feet 4 inches. The ball is moving right to left. What do they say? Just put it straight. Pick your target. I pick my target. Now just put it straight. We are going downhill. So uh, by quite a bit. So I'm thinking I probably need somewhere in the neighborhood of a, uh, oh, probably a 17 foot putt. I'm not positive about that. Get there. Yeah. Okay, so we got a bogey on the first one, but we'll uh, we'll take it, uh, especially with a breakfast ball, right? This hole, I can't imagine if I was right that it is fifty eight hundred yards in total, with that first hole being. Uh, what was it, about 212, 214 for the first hole. And now this hole, it's a par five and it's 522 yards. See if we can get a good drive here. Good strike, a little low in flight.
All right. That'll work. 300 yards. I'm trying to decide what club I might want to hit. Why don't we go with a six? Yeah, let's go with the six hybrid. Now, what's making me think I might want to change my mind is only, I, I believe I'm going to be hitting into downhill, and then I'm going to be going uphill after that. But uh, we'll stick with this club. If we could have somewhere in the neighborhood of 140 yards or so coming in, that would be fine by me. Anything less than that's a bonus. Good strike. Oh, I like it. Okay. It's pretty much what I wanted. Now, we are hitting uphill. 134, 15 yards uphill. So we're saying 149. I am going to pull out, I believe, my 7 iron. Let's see. It's hiding here. I think I've cleaned it off. I have. When you hit into impact screens, you don't want your golf ball to be dirty and you don't want your clubs to be dirty. Otherwise, they'll mar up the screen. Now, I call this an impact screen. I actually, the impact screen is behind my photography backdrop. One, say 149, because 134 and going uphill. Oh, crossed it. Okay. I tend to do that. Tend to do that. Especially indoors. For some reason. Going across rather than going out. So we have 29 yards. Coming in. Let's hit a good one here. Good strike. Oh yeah, I like that. Okay, and we walked away with a par on that one. That was nice. And we are going to finish it off with a par four that is 313 yards. It looks to be fairly open to me, so I am going to pull out driver. For a half second there, I thought maybe I would hit a, uh, maybe I would hit a three wood or even a seven wood, but looks to be open. All right, let's have a good drive here, Paul. Good strike. I actually fell backwards on that one. <laughs> that was weird. All right, distance is okay. And 98 yards to come in. My A is my 95 to 105 club typically. I'm trying to look at the back of the green, worried if I need, if I hit it too far, but I don't think I need to be worried. Decent strike. All right. I like it. And we'll pull out the putter here. Start off going right to left, but then end going left right. So, as I'm going to say, when in doubt, putt straight. Uphill slightly, 12 feet 7 inches. 
I need to hit the impact screen, but not too much stronger than that. <laughs> it hung on the edge. So uh, anyway, took a par on that one. So uh, thank you for joining me in my golf cave today. Again, this one is uh, Lake Mori Country Club and uh, in Vermont, and uh, looks like a very nice course. Thank you for joining me at Golf Cave today. Much appreciated.